What happens when bailiffs evict tenants? Get advice if you get an eviction notice from the bailiffs. Sometimes the court can stop or delay an eviction. You can or contact a shelter advisor. Find other organizations offering free advice. It helps if you have your notice and court paperwork ready. How you know the bailiffs are coming. Bailiffs must give you two weeks notice of an eviction date. The notice of eviction is addressed to anyone named on the court order and any other occupiers. It comes in a sealed transparent envelope and should be posted through your letterbox or attached to the door. On the eviction date, most evictions are carried out by county court bailiffs between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. Some landlords use High Court Enforcement Officers HCEOs to carry out the eviction. HCEOs cannot turn up before 6 a.m. or after 9 p.m. The notice of eviction from the bailiffs should confirm the date and time. If you're still at the property when the bailiffs arrive, they will ask you to leave. Ask to see their identification. They must have this with them. Bailiffs must not use violence or offensive language. You should be ready to leave and hand the keys back. They may allow you a short time to move your belongings out, but it's best to do this in advance. If you leave belongings in the property, bailiffs do not have to give you extra time to pack your things. You may have to arrange with your landlord to collect any belongings left behind. Bailiffs must not damage your belongings. They cannot keep your belongings to pay for court costs or for rent arrears. Unless the court makes a separate order that says they can do this. Your landlord must keep your belongings safe for a reasonable time. You could be charged for storage or removal if you do not collect them. You may be able to claim money from your landlord if they dispose of your belongings without your permission. If you'll be homeless after eviction, you can ask the council for help as soon as you're at risk of eviction. You do not have to wait until the eviction date. You may qualify for emergency or long-term housing if you meet certain conditions. The council may also help you find a new home. 